Hey, Chameleon.com here. Today we're going to be doing an overview for the highest rated oil filter on Amazon.com. It is the Bosch Filtech oil filter, and it comes for every make and model imaginable. I mean, look at this. There's like literally a hundred different choices. But before I go any further, guys, as always, we're going to have links in the description below to ensure that you get the best price on your oil filter and automotive purchase today. And be sure to check us out at Chameleon.com because... Not only are we going to be putting this thing through the ringer, but we're also going to be talking about earth magnets for the oil filter. Are they worth it? Is it legit? And why I recommend them in certain instances. I'll get into that in just a moment. But check us out at chameleon.com. Every automotive accessory known to man. We have magnetic mounts for your phone in your car. We have car tools, accessories, seat covers, you name it. We got it. Check us out today. And let's get into why people have chosen the Bosch Filtech oil filter as the top rated oil filter on Amazon. So it is the exclusive Filtech media technology that screens out more harmful contaminants for greater injury protection, has a strong steel base plate and houses and housings to prevent warpage, a warpage. Warpage, leaks, and poor fit, my gosh. Silicone anti-drain back valve ensures supply of clean oil when the vehicle is started and high luber lubricity. Gasket design provides a tight seal yet allows for easy remote removal. And just listen to this. Listen to that seal. That is a good rubber seal on that thing, I must say. So let's get into this a little bit more. And I'm going to show you guys the box, as always. And they also have a couple different levels of this oil filter. They have like a premium one, if you can see this, if it'll focus. Let me zoom in really quick. There we go. So they have, uh, the one I have in front of me is the premium, okay? And it's 99% effective, but they have ones that go all the way up to 99.9, .9, and those are also extremely high rated on Amazon. This is 639 for the Distance Plus, which I think is the second highest rated and then this one is a 2032 customer reviews becomes because people just love this thing and it comes in every single make and model now how do i feel about these auto magnets these these uh not auto magnets earth magnets that people put on the oil filters well i actually do recommend putting them on your oil filter and i'll explain to you why and then i'm going to get to the criticism that most people say about not putting them on but I'll get into all this filter media stuff in a second. I just want to get into uh, why you should use actual magnets on your oil filter, whatever oil filter you buy. Is this reason right here? Bear with me. So, a couple things. A lot of manufacturers now actually put a magnetic drain plug into the oil pan where you drain the oil originally from the car before you pull, before you pull the oil filter off. And that's reason enough for me to believe that if manufacturing manufacturers are putting a magnetic um, drain plug from the factory, mind you, on their drain on the drain pan, then it would constitute putting some magnets on your oil filter to really get out any ferrous material that might be floating around in your oil, which looks something like this in your engine. Okay, let me see if I can zoom in a little bit more. So this is a good animation for this, but. You'll see what, the oil filter does a good job up to like uh, 15, 20 microns. And just for an example of that, a micron is, I have a size thing pulled up. So here's the size of a white blood cell. It's 25 microns. And I believe this is rated to 20 or 15 microns. I'll come back to the micron rating in a second. But no matter what the size, this is what a lot of people say about this in the in the forums. No matter what the size of the of the metallic material in your oil floating around is, it doesn't matter if it's if it's if it's of the same hardness, it can do damage. So you really want to make sure that let me, uh, pull out of here that you're getting rid of as much. Um, metallic material floating around in your oil, which is why you should change your oil in the first place, not only because of combustion, but because of really metal shavings that happen from uh, friction in your engine. And the other thing is, I wanted to show you this really quick. If I can find it. So you'll see, here's a good example of what it looks like after people put on a magnetic um, 
oil filter catch, I guess you would call it. They look like this after they pour out all the oil. And this is all the metal that is gathering on the actual magnets of these, uh, of these things around the filter itself. Now, here's where I don't recommend them and do recommend them, okay? So, on our site, we have the earth magnets. You can get them for, like, prices fluctuate, but you can get, like, a 10-pack for 5 bucks, 10 bucks, really more toward, like, 5 bucks. And if you go for, like, a really well-made filter mag, it's, like, $100. So, $100... $10, $100, $10. You got to really weigh if paying $100 for a magnet on your oil filter is worth it. And it's not as beautifully marketed, but you can really just take a ring of these things for 10 bucks, and they the magnets are so great that they just they go in like a row like this. You just orientate them right, and when you change your oil uh, on your car, just take off the magnets and then put them on the next one. So that's my, that's my two cents about it. I think discarding any amount of ferrous material from your car engine is important whether it's under 20 microns or not so that's my honest opinion about the magnets and for five bucks you really can't go wrong for a hundred it's like the cost of like three four oil changes depending where you go so i don't know about that but i do recommend it for five bucks um that's my honest opinion on it otherwise because people are paying what, five bucks for the oil filter? You paid like five bucks for this thing? Yeah, they're like, mine was nine, but like any, any, most all of them are like five to ten bucks for just the oil filter. So that's ten times the cost of a, or twenty times the cost, depending on what car you have. So I don't know if twenty times the cost for a magnet is really worth it because the filter's doing already a pretty good job of getting out any sort of metal or clumpage or anything like that. So that's, I'm going to stop touching on that. I'm going to read off um, why these are the best oil filters, and I'm going to leave off on that note. So the ultimate in engine protection, I'm going to zoom in on this so you guys can see. Uh, premium engine performance, let me get my pointer here. Premium engine performance requires a premium oil filter. Bosch premium oil filters protect your engine by keeping harmful particles and dirt are out, preventing premature wear and engine failure. Premium oil filters not only fit the same way as original OE filters, they utilize an exclusive blend of natural and synthetic materials in the media for superior oil filtration and increased engine protection at manufacturer specifies replacement intervals. Bosch premium oil filters will maintain high performance and prolong the life of your engine, avoiding costly repairs. And you'll see that from 1 to 6. It's got a metal spiral wound center tube, and you can kind of see the inside. I wonder if I can turn the flash on while I'm doing this. You can kind of see it, but it's got a really nice metallic uh, spiral inside. It's got the end caps, number two, prevent trap contaminants from reaching your engine. So that's what these end caps do on the side of the filter, as you can see here. See these little end caps? The premium media provides 99% filtration efficiency which is pretty impressive silicone anti-drain back valve which is kind of like this little uh if you can see the orange bit in between these little holes on top uh that is the silicone anti-drain back valve it protects against dry starts and it doesn't dry out and it's got a, re a relief valve on the inside you really can't see it but it prevents oil restriction and ensures proper oil flow and number six is it's got a nitrile sealing gasket internally lubricated gasket has a long life and will not dry out i do believe that but like any other mechanic i would definitely oil this with the uh, oil that comes out of your car when you initially put this in just put a little bit of oil right here and it helps this thing go right from the get-go it's got an oe fit proper fit rest assured the filter will fit and stay on your on the vehicle the same way as the original filter that was put on during the production of your car so this is OE specifications, apparently, OE fit. And it's got a 99% efficiency, traps small engine damaging particles. A high glass content is woven into the blended media inside of this oil filter, providing a greater efficiency and strength and a 14 gram capacity to hold on to engine damaging particles. Premium filtration media has a capacity to hold 14 grams of dirt from entering the engine. And I wonder if I can see the micron rating for this. Uh, 
Um, people are saying this in the comments. Don't don't quote me on this, but apparently with full synthetic oil, you can run this filter for 10 to 12K. Uh, synthetic blend, 7 to 8K, and with conventional, 4 to 5K. So it's a very good filter, I must say. Quality oil filter. Uh, 20 micron media, that's what it is. So it's filtering out stuff um, smaller than a white blood cell, correct? So 20 mic, yeah, white blood cell is 25 micron. This apparently is a 20 micron filter media. Pretty impressed. I like it a lot. It's got a good, uh, good rubber smell to it. And I think we're going to leave pretty much on that note. If you want to go for a higher, uh, quality one, I suggest the Bosch high premium or performance premium. And those are also available in the links in the description below. And once again, guys, I'm going to pretty much leave out on that note. I do recommend putting a ring of... If you're going to do the magnets, I forgot to mention this when I was talking about the magnets, but I'll leave out on this note if you're still with me, guys. When you buy the magnets at Chameleon, make sure that when you put these on, you put them on in a ring, like all the way around in a ring. So you're going to get like a 10 or a 20 pack. I would suggest a 20 to be safe because then you got a couple left over to put on the bottom of the... Uh, oil filter itself and it's going to be this is where gravity is going to be catching a lot of it but it's good to have the ring and a couple on the bottom so it's not only getting the stuff that's collecting right here but it's getting the whole 360 degree of how the oil actually flows through the filter and this is actually a fairly good animation of it right here and you can see that it's really it really flows out from just about everywhere of the filter media a lot of it collects toward the bottom but you do want to have a good solid ring around the whole thing and then at least uh one or two on the top right here and if you have a drain plug in your car that's not magnetic you can just throw one of these guys right on the drain plug and it makes the uh the tip magnetic so you can just wipe it off at the time of your oil change that's pretty much it guys on that note chameleon.com is out links in the description below for the best prices on your automotive or car purchase today and be sure to check us out at chameleon.com on that note chameleon.com is out peace